Bitcoin gold is in correction along with all the other cryptocurrencies and it's doing what it's supposed to be doing so far. But do we still have awesome potential in Bitcoin gold? We're about to find out now. On my screen, I have the short-term view of Bitcoin gold and we have retraced. In our last video, I had two alternate patterns. The green was our primary and like with other cryptos, what I was calling the wave one was actually more likely the wave three. And I have the new pattern in purple. We topped in a wave one on right around $94. And we've pulled back almost 61.8%, which is a really good, healthy pullback correction for wave two. But we're not out of the woods yet. As much as I like this pullback, we don't have any clear indication that it's over yet. And as I mentioned, we didn't quite hit our 61.8% retrace. Usually the 61.8% is your support level. But in this case, we may see this thing bounce a little bit lower than 61.8%, and we may still have a healthy rally coming. And that's why this 61.8% retrace line, which is at 56.80, is marked in gold at the moment. This is a preferred bottom, so we could swing a little lower, and then I would like to see a powerful reversal right after that. Otherwise, our actual red support now is going to be about 48.23, and this is just like with all the other, several of the other cryptos, we have a 76.4% support. If that breaks, then we may be in some trouble with Bitcoin gold. So as long as we hold, it's a decent time to buy. If you're trying to buy a lump sum, if you can find a way to buy one. And if we do hold and we rally, our wave three target has been adjusted upward a bit just because of this higher wave one. So the projection is falling between 138 and 152. And after a fourth wave consolidation, we're looking at targets of 160 to 175 actually. And when it comes to the big picture, there's some good news and there's some bad news. Good news is we have a nice, healthy one-two pattern. The bad news is, is that our incredible green pattern that I was marking as, as our primary pattern may not quite, well, we don't have the, it doesn't look like we have the juice for it right now. We should have rallied close to 117 plus on the wave one alone, but we didn't quite make it there. Uh, as I mentioned, we're below $100 actually on our first uh, wave one top. Uh, it makes the purple wave our primary count. And we're looking at a projection right now that could get us up to anywhere from 288 to the 530 range. And that's based on a couple of Fibonacci equivalencies here. First of which is based on the larger rally that we had that ended earlier this year. Assuming that we this was actually a third wave top as marked in purple, 0 0.382, 0 0.5, and 0 0.618 extensions are commonly the top targets for a wave five. And that would put us between 117 and 288. Because of how strongly we rallied in the wave one, I'm putting that estimate close to 288 minimum. That's where, the, where this purple box stands. And we have a max target based on just doing a Fibonacci logarithmic extension of the one, two that we have so far. And that takes somewhere between 533 and maybe as far as 716. I need to extend that box up a little bit. So we're still looking at two and a half, three, four, five, maybe six X returns, even with this more conservative pattern. I would like to highlight that there is a red pattern here. If you've been watching my other videos, this is a consistent alternate pattern that I have across pretty much all the cryptos. And that's that the correction that ended a few months ago was actually an A wave, not the whole two wave, but rather the A sub wave of the larger wave two, and that we've had a fake out rally, which is a B wave, and we have a wave C coming to complete the two and flush us out. Good thing is only a handful of cryptos have broken their support so far and nothing has broken it since that swoon we had earlier last week. Things are looking healthy, relatively bullish. So stay tuned for more updates. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you for watching and happy trading.